Hello and welcome to 3.0TV. I am your host Shubham. In today's special segment, we will discuss what triggered the recent fall in the cryptocurrencies and assess the impact of it in the near future. Well, the key factor that sent cryptocurrencies market cap below one trillion dollar mark was the Securities and Exchanges Commission directive to Kraken that required the exchanges to shut staking operations in the US. Here's the complete rundown to this episode that debuted on 9th February 2023. and triggered a series of events that eventually culminated in the US SEC targeting of crypto staking and fall in crypto prices crypto exchange kraken bowed down to US SEC's demand and agreed to pay the penalty that decision roiled the market with retail investors upping their sell orders soon the market's entered into a downfall with bitcoin losing more than 4% while ethereum lost almost 5% So let's hear for SEC's chairman Gary Gensler on the Kraken staking program and what does that mean for retail investors. For those who are uninitiated into what happened here, tell it to me like I'm 5. What, what what was Kraken doing and what was the problem that you were trying to solve? Um Andrew what Kraken was doing was asking the American public for their uh coins, uh crypto tokens. and saying I'll give you a return 4% to 21% returns and the problem was they were not disclosing to the investing public uh the risk that the investing public Kraken knew how to register others know how to register it's just a form on our website they can come in talk to our talented people and disclosure review teams and if they want to offer staking we're neutral come in register because investors need that disclosure what are you doing with the tokens are you trading against the right. tokens are you borrowing against the token are you using them for your own purposes and we've seen this in the crypto field so investors not only need that disclosure but it's the law right. coinbase ceo brian armstrong called the regulation of crypto staking a terrible path for retail traders meanwhile The New York Department of Financial Services ordered crypto infrastructure firm Paxos to stop issuing the stablecoin Binance USD, a Binance spokesperson said. Interestingly, the crypto staking market size was about 23% of the total market value of digital assets at the end of 2022. Of this, the value of staked assets was 42 billion dollars. Well, we know that financial markets have evolved on the principle of zero sum game where a loss for one is a gain for another. In this case, the governance tokens have raked in gains. Lido and Rocket, two of the largest pool staking services, soared as high as 11% according to data from CoinGecko. Meanwhile, the crypto markets took off in Feb on a strong footing led by strong US jobs data. But things quickly turned negative for bullish camp as Fed officials also hinted at the need to continue with aggressive interest rate hikes in order to bring inflation back down to the central bank's target rate. Well, that's it in today's special segment. If you want to learn more about what is crypto staking, then please click on the link given in the description below. Well, this is Shubham Joshi signing off. Keep watching 3.0 TV for more such interesting updates. Please like and share our videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to get instant updates. Have a great day.